Hi there, this is Tony from Pianotone.ca. Have you ever had a mono audio file that you wanted to quickly turn into a stereo audio file? Well, this is going to be a super quick video on how to do exactly that with a free DAW app called Audacity in Windows 10. I recently bought a new audio interface and a new mixer, and I occasionally have been having issues where I've recorded a piano re review video or something, and I, the audio track ends up being mono, and I know it's got something to do with how my camera recording app is uh, interacting with my audio interface, and I will figure that out. But because I don't want to have to redo those videos, uh, I started looking for a quick and easy way to just convert uh, mono to stereo, and I came up with this solution that I'm about to show you. So let's check it out. So step one is to download and install Audacity. I'll leave a link in the description uh, below for uh, where you can uh, find that. Uh, Audacity is a free DAW, so digital audio workstation uh, software for Windows and Mac. I don't actually use it myself for anything other than uh, converting mono to stereo, so I don't really uh, know a whole bunch about it, but I know a lot of people really like it. One thing about Audacity, if you are curious about using it uh, as your DAW software, is that it only works with audio tracks. There's no MIDI compatibility in Audacity. Okay, so now that you have Audacity uh, installed, go ahead and run it. Then uh, either choose uh, File and Open, and then uh, navigate to uh, where your uh, mono file is, and then open it, or you could also just drag and drop it in here. So uh, once I've uh, opened this file, you can see that I've only got uh, one side, which is why it's uh, mono. So let's just have a quick listen to that. Hi there, this is Tony from Pianotone.ca, and this video is... So you can hear that's only coming out of the left-hand uh, side. So uh, first thing to do is just right click in this open area here and sit, select uh, split stereo track. And that's going to make two tracks out of one track. Then to get rid of this empty track, you're going to click the little X on that and that will delete the, uh, the empty track. So now the next thing to do is to, uh, you need to select this uh, mono track here. So you do that by just clicking the select button. You can see the background turns white. Then from the edit menu, if you go uh, duplicate, you can now see I've got two tracks that are exactly the same. Now in the top uh, track, the original one, if I right click in this open area, I can go make stereo track and it returns it back to being stereo. So I'll just uh, have a quick listen to that. Hi there, this is Tony from pianotone.ca and this... So you can see now we've got a stereo track and then now to uh, export it, we just go file export and you can do it as mp3 or different file formats but you're most likely just going to want to choose wave so you can choose wave and export it and now you've got a stereo version of your track so i hope you found this video useful and if so please smash the like button and subscribe to my channel that really helps me out have an awesome day